Hello and welcome aboard the Voyager 960 cabin. Currently we are in uh, Helsinki, Finland on an exhibition and I would like to show you this awesome pure aluminum boat from Rebo. Starting from the bow of that boat, um, we have the same, almost the same design as we have on the 700 cabin. That means we have stable and sturdy cleats, we have uh, the railings here, um, and we have uh, thread plates from aluminum glued to the fully aluminum hull, which is uh, 5083 aluminum alloy. And uh, the whole boat is uh, 960 in length, so 9 meters basic design, 60 centimeters swimming platforms. We have a uh, cleat here in the middle. Um, uh, we have a lot of space to walk around the ship. So as you can see, I'm just moving easily without even holding on here. In the back of the boat, we have a very clean and spacious design and uh, a lot of places and lockers where you can store your stuff. We have a locker here where you can put like lines and uh, everything you need for your daily work on the boat. Um, uh, we have easy access for uh, maintenance here. Here are currently two batteries um, for powering all the interior. Uh, we have a storage space over here which holds the battery for the engines, uh, also the main switches and uh, the same thing on the other side a locker where you can put all your stuff you need and we have two additional lockers that also function as seatings while traveling with that boat the swim platforms on that boat are big enough to stand on big enough to get out of the water when swimming we also have a compartment here which is um, uh, big enough to hold your uh, additional daily needs. Um, this one, as you can see, is really durable and sturdy. And uh, we have an electrical anchor winch in the back and easy access for maintaining the anchor winch. As you can see, the back of the boat has a very clean and spacious design and uh, a lot of nice features, uh, which I really like. The, especially uh, the two lamps in the targa are really nice to uh, enlighten the deck at night. Um, the door slides very easy and we will take a look in the cabin right now. Entering the boat uh, you will find the kitchenette on the right hand side. Um, this is standard feature of the boat. It has a sink, it has a lot of space for your everyday needs. Uh, right now here is a fridge installed and uh, here's also a sliding door um, uh, which holds your other everyday stuff that you need and now we're gonna do, go to the console and take a look at the driver's place so right here in the captain's chair uh, you have everything you need in hand and full control over your boat you have the uh, lever control for um, the engines um, at hand you have um, the trim tabs uh, wipers, um, three wipers installed and standard in that boat. Uh, you have everything for the anchors, uh, the cabin lights, etc. Uh, you also have the heating control system over here. So, and still, even if there's so much and so much space that you can easily put a 16 inch chart plotter in here, you have a really good line of sight and a full overview about what you're doing in that boat. On this version of the uh, cabin, we have a single passenger seat here um, in the front. Uh, in standard, there is a seating bench, which uh, is easily to adjust for weather, um, looking outside and watching, or even turning around and uh, having dinner with a family, because this place accommodates four people. 
in the cabin you have a lot of sleeping space for uh, two people um, which is very very comfortable and uh, very spacey so you can easily sleep in here uh, without um, having the feeling of something is too small it uh, has a very nice interior and a lot of space to um, put your needs in here uh, we have lockers on the left and on the right side and also a lot of space to um, uh, store things here plus uh, you can remove this cushion here and remove this plate here and then you also have um, a nice place to sit for at least three people. One of the most important places in the boat of this size is uh, the toilet. That is standard on the boat and is really big in size so you have a lot of space here and the toilet also functions as a shower so you can also shower in here which is uh, really nice if you do a weekend trip far away from any marina. That was a short overview over the Voyager 960 cabin to give you an impression of uh, that boat which is in my opinion perfect for uh, families for weekend trips or even a week trip. So if you want to cruise around on the Baltic uh, this boat is perfect made for you.